set and away they go from the 1900 metre marker. 32 squadron is along the inside, Pearly King, the grey born to rule. Electric Jet is further back, Royal Mac has the yellow cap near the rail. And Mr. Royal's a little bit strong on the outside with the blue cap that's racing in fifth position. Then Electric Jet Battle Ammo lays the trail. Dun Career, they're followed by Priceless Gem. Royce Jet is back second to last. And Bezart's the trailer about 14 lengths off the leader. The Grey, born to rule now, takes it up. 32 squadron is second. Pearly King, Black Sleeves and Cap. And then Royal Mac on the outside, Mr. Royal with the blue cap. Then Electric Jet, that race is in sixth position, about five lengths to track down. A length in front of Blaze the Trail, Battle Hammer. Then comes Priceless Gem, Dun Careers further back in the run. Royce Jet, and at the back is Bezard. No pace on, which will sue 32 Squadron, and it's born to rule who leads it. Now 32 Squadron gets a niggle or two near the rail. Pearly King is on the outside. Royal Mac has the yellow cap. Mr. Royal Electric Jet then blaze the trail. Further back in the field at this stage, giving them about seven lengths start as priceless gem battle hammer. And then comes Royce Jet, Dunkare, and Bezard. Top of the lane, Born to Rule still leads it. Pearly King's going to challenge. 32 Squadron's going to go in. The Red Sleeves and Cab. Then Mr. Royal. Blaze the trail is on the outside. Then Royal Mac. 300 to go. Born to Rule still the leader. 32 Squadron. Pearly King on the outside. The Grey Born to Rule. 32 Squadron. Pearly King tries to fight back. Priceless Gem putting in a good claim on the outside. 32 Squadron. Priceless Gem coming on powerfully. Born to Rule. 32 Squadron's looking for the line. Priceless Gem and Mr. Royal. Here comes the line. 32 Squadron won it. Blaze the trail ran on nicely. A wall of horses involved for the minor placing. Thirty-two squadron went down the inside of the track. You'll see Anton changes his stick to the left hand, was looking for the line. Just look how the race changed for the minor placings. Born to rules the grey, Mr. Royal the blue cap, blaze the trail, priceless gem, and thirty-two squadron wins it. Blaze the trail runs on nicely, number six for the second. Mr. Royal will run third. Uh, let's see the fourth place. Uh, perhaps that goes to Born to Rule, then Priceless Gem and Pearly King. Further back in the field is Electric Jet, and then came further back Battle Hammer, Dun Carrere, Bez Art, and then came Royal Mac. So we'll take a look at that head on shortly, and then take a look at when we show the replay of the head on. 32 squadrons on the left hand side, the grey is born to rule. Pearly King, Black Sleeves and Cap. Blaze the trail, two off the right, really runs on nicely. Priceless Gem gets tight for Electric Jet on the right-hand side. Anton's got the stick in his left hand. He now changes to his left, uh, right hand to his left hand, and 32 Squadron wins it. Blaze the trail, Mr. Royal, born to rule, Priceless Gem, all involved in the minor placings until the running of race number four back to the studio. Well, it's only an E-Division class, merit-rated 69 handicap, over 1,900 meters. But one would think it's a big win here for number three, 32 squadron. The three-year-old son of AP Arrow only having his third start over 1,900 meters. And I think Charles Laird and his team, and we'll chat to Anton about this win. They've done a fantastic job here for Alesh Naidu and Mickey Goss. Let's have a chat to trainer Charles Laird and uh, talk to him about the source. Firstly, Charlie. 1600 last time, blinkers on, and uh, he seemed to enjoy the trip, but today was a test for him. No, it was. Uh, I think we really threw him in the deep end, and he's come out swimming. Um, but I'd, I'd like to start and say a big thank you to Mick. Um, we, we've had him for a few months, and, um, and uh, Alesh asked Mick if he could buy into him, and, you know, he's a true gentleman. Um, you know, I think he showed today that he, he's got something. I really believe it was, a, was a big win, I mean, against these older, hard-knocking horses, and he, he's still a young horse. 
Yeah, you know, they were obvious concern, but he seemed to have answered it and answered it uh, with the plum. No, absolutely. You know, um, also for me, they went a bit slow, um, which didn't really suit him. But he's won and, and he's won very well. Charlie, before you leave us later on this evening, you like anything? Yeah, we've got one more German lady. I think she's a big runner. I'm just a little bit concerned at the 1,000 meter. Um, there's some very quick fillies, and she has shown that probably her best form is over 1,200, but she's very well at home. Thanks for that, Charlie. Thank you. Lovely. Let's get Anton Marcus in. A nice double for Anton. Anton, firstly, compliments on the ride. Uh, you know, I watched the race halfway through, and you were keeping the source alive in the race. Yeah, you know, he's, I, I was actually happy that he raced like that because um, I, I had reservations about the trip. You know, last time he raced pretty hard with Kevin, albeit that he won by four or five lengths. You know, I thought, he, I thought he pretty much had enough last time at the line. You know, you just have to have a look at what he beat. He beat Uri's gold. Yeah, he franked the form, but it wasn't as good a win as what it appeared visually, you know. So for him to step up, you know, as I said earlier, you know, the, the detractors will say, a rating's a rating. But it doesn't always work that way with young horses, you know. You're still taking on, on hard knockers that have, as, as I mentioned earlier, I'm reiterating, that have crossed the line in front three and six times. You know, it's not as if they're totally out of form either, you know. So I thought it was a very big win tonight. It's all about thinking in the saddle, and you've got uh, vast experience. You're one of the top jocks uh, in the country, and, uh, you know, full marks to you. For the boys that took a chance and banked the source in the pick six, you've got one man to thank. Nice ride, here, Anton. Thank you, Dees. Well done to jockey Anton Marcus. Let's get uh, Alesh Naidu in. Alesh, we had a lengthy chat uh, this morning at breakfast during the course of the day. You had your concerns, but in saying that, Charlie mentioned to you that the source is very well. No, definitely the horse was very well, but it's, uh, it was thrown in the deep end. And 1,600, 1,900, it's a big task, and against the field, it's quite odd. But he came through flying colors. I want to say well done to Anton Marcus, top right. Well done to Charles Led. Well done to my partner, Mickey Goss. Talking about Mickey Goss, you're a guy that supports his uh, stud farm, and uh, he's given you a share here in the source, and uh, not too long ago this happened, and he's given you a share in a, in a lovely horse, Alesh. No, no, he's a good guy. We thank him for that. How was the sales for you? I know you put your hand up on the Sunday. You bought, you bought the big lot there, 1.2 million. Saturday, uh, Friday, uh, you, you get a few? Yeah, I got about three on Friday night, and on, on Sunday was a big one we got. Things looking good. I mean, I've just had a look at the stats. Things looking good for you as an owner, unless uh, you had a great start to the season. Yeah, no, we've got some good uh, babies coming up, and we hope the season will continue the way it's going at the moment. Well, uh, keep it up, and uh, I must ask, did you get some 22 to 10? A little, not too much. Well done, Alesh. Sure, thank you. Lovely. Well done to Alesh Naidu here on number three, 32 squadron, who's come through to open up the pick six. And uh, as I mentioned, if you took a chance and banked the source as we did on the first call show, well, we're smiling. But a great ride by Anton Marcus. Three, six, seven, and eight, your provisional result, race number three. If you want to get involved in the jackpot, which will be the last exotic this evening, the time to jot down there for race number four will be 19.45, a quarter to eight coming up next. The last exotic, the jackpot, race number four.